One of the main points about batting is obviously your grip. And on the grip side, the most important is your bottom hand grip. So I'm a right hand batsman, so my bottom hand is my right hand, and that is the most important grip. Now, how should my bottom hand grip be? So my bottom hand grip should be a V between the outside edge and the splice of the handle. Okay, this is the right grip. And I'll tell you why this is the right grip. But before that, I'll show you what happens and how you can check whether this grip is right or not. If your grip is right, when you turn the bat face like that, the handle will finish on your forearm, okay? So that is the checkpoint that your bottom hand grip is right. Now, just have a look what happens if my bottom hand grip turns. Now, if my bottom hand grip turns, this is what is going to happen. That handle is not going to be against my forearm. Okay, so that is a checkpoint that something is not right. Now, what happens in batting with a lot of young players? First problem they have is they have a heavy bat which they can't control. Now, because they have that heavy bat which they can't control, when they wait here, instead of the fingers staying over the handle, the fingers go under the handle. And the moment that happens, that is literally death knell for your batting. Because what will happen is, if you pick up the bat from here, the bat face will close, and you are gonna be playing with a stump rather than a full face bat. So this is what happens. The other thing that happens is the moment your bottom hand loads up or chokes up, the weight gets on the back leg. Now, my, when my weight gets on the back leg like this, my head goes, I choke, head goes off side of the ball, and I'm in all sorts of trouble, okay? So that's why keeping that bottom hand grip right is extremely important. Now I'll show you something more that happens if your bottom hand grip is right. So if your bottom hand grip is right, when you pick the bat up, look what happens to my right elbow. There is a gap here, which you can see, and the elbow bone, right elbow bone, is pointing towards fine, fine leg, which means that I can access the ball full face, offside, leg side, anywhere. Okay, now look what happens if my grip changes. So if now my grip goes here under the handle, this is what is going to happen. So I'm going to pick the bat up. My elbow go bone has gone towards long leg. And the moment my elbow bone has gone towards long leg, my bottom hand has taken control and I'm going to be playing like this. So I'm hardly going to have anything to do on the offside. Left arm spinner, leg spinner, any away going bowler is going to cause me a lot of problem. And my only, uh, what do you call, release is going to be mid wicket long on, which you see in a lot of young players. They can't drive the ball. They can't play mid off, extra cover mid on because their grip is not right. So this is one of the main things about batting which a young player needs to get right. So you will see in our videos, our young players will pick the bats up and it's going to be exactly like this. So you're tapping the bat with your top hand, you come in, as you go up, your bat toe is at the sky, my right elbow is at fine, fine leg, okay? And if I'm going forward, I've got a good, decent heel contact in my front foot, okay? So this is where I want to be. This is the position from where I can defend 
I can attack, I can be balanced, and I can have a solid base as well as generate power when I need to. At the same time, if I have to go soft, I can do that. If I have to place the ball, I can do that. That's a really good position to get into, but unless my bottom hand grip is right, I cannot do that. So it's really important to get this bottom hand grip right.